Beetlejuice. 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 Where the heck are you, dude? Okay. Well, he never came to me, but he did come back to the theaters. I thought the Beetlejuice sequel was fresh. I saw it here in Granite City. Check out the little Route 66 lighted attraction here. Anyway, Michael Keaton was great. It was probably a little less physical than the original. I thought the storyline was interesting. A very fresh sink, very fresh sequel. And Jenna Ortega is a nice, you know, nice addition. What a talent. Uh, Winona Ryder did a good job of playing a traumatized person. Catherine O'Hara is always interesting. Justin Thoreau slash uh, Aniston, his character, a sensitive new age guy. That, that wore a little thin. They played that hand a little heavy. But interesting universe. Um, you know, there were some new special effects they played with, but to me, the the, the great uh, surprise and pleasure. I absolutely love Monica Bellucci. Monica Bellucci. Mm. You know, she's more than just somebody who popped up in the Matrix. Uh, an Italian legend. There's a movie called Molina that I could watch 10 times, even though it's, I don't think there's a word in English, but uh, Monica Bellucci, even though she's, you know, the undead, let's just put it that way. You know, I don't think that's a big spoiler alert. She's just, um, she's she's outstanding. I'm, I'm a huge fan and thought she fit into this movie beautifully. A very fresh villain. Let's just say, I'll give that away. But Michael Keaton was fun. Um, just in general, the um, and the uh, you know the various afterlife uh, social services type offices. There, there was really a new fresh twist on that. There, there's one thing I want to discuss, but I don't want to give it away. Maybe I'll, I'll discuss this in a week. But uh, if you like the original Beetlejuice, I think you'll like this. I think. Uh, they're nice tributes to the original, and uh, the cast got it done. They didn't rush this, they put a good script together, so I think you'll enjoy a couple of the plot twists, and I just thought it was, you know, well done. Movie of the century for me, I mean, I liked Beetlejuice. Wasn't a crazy, uh, off-the-charts fan, but I think you'll like it.